Hey everyone, we are taking a quick closer look at this 12 volt car battery tester. Uh, now I have to say I have used this probably about four times now on two different vehicles to just get a good thorough test of it. And it does seem to be very accurate. I'm actually shocked at how well this actually works. The vehicles that I used it on um, was my truck. Um, and also my ATV as well. And what's cool about this is that you can use this on a wide variety of different vehicles. Not only those, if you have a jet ski battery, if you have a motorcycle battery, um, a regular car battery, you can use this for a wide variety of different batteries. Um, and it does seem to be very accurate. I've tested it uh, multiple days apart. Uh, I tested it twice on my truck and then two times on my ATV. Um, and it works very thoroughly. I actually, the first time that I tested it on my ATV, which is the reason why I got this, the battery was low, which is what I suspected. Um, so I actually trickle charged it and then came back and tested it again, and it was much higher, and it seems to be very accurate. Uh, it does seem to tell me what's actually going on, and uh, it told me that my ATV battery was low, recharge it, then it told me my ATV battery was good. Um, another thing that's cool is that uh, in the menu, you can actually decide if the, you can select if the battery is in the vehicle still, or if it's outside the vehicle. So there's multiple kind of parameter settings that you can choose from uh, while you use this. So you don't have to have this battery in your vehicle. If you have like um, um, like the ATV battery and it's outside of the vehicle, you can um, check it if it's outside the vehicle as well. Um, so I don't know the different parameters of how it like determines that, uh, but that is a setting that's in there. Um, also there is like a, there's a check option and then there's like um, a result option too as well. So you can like like compare like what your last test was to like your new one um, and it, it works really good the menu is very easy and simple to use the instructions are super clear if you've never used one of these before and really for what this is it, it works super well i'm very impressed with it so far um, now there is one thing that i was a little confused about when i first got it um, and that was like oh how come there's no like on button or i can't turn it on um, i kind of felt like a dummy for a second uh, you actually have to connect it to a battery first for this to turn on so you have to connect it to a battery and then you will see the menu here pop up I was just a little confused when I first got it because I'm like, well, how do I look at the menu? Then I realized I actually just have to have it on a battery first. Um, how to connect it is super simple. You just have these built-in cables. Of course, you know where these go. So very easy to use, uh, very user-friendly and functional. I love the uh, the testing that it does. It seems very accurate and I have had a good experience with, a good experience with this product and I can't recommend this enough.